Hi guys, April Hunt here. Um, I'm working with Shoot again today, and I had four shoots lined up out at this uh, Cook's Landing Pier out in Hermitage, and I wanted y'all to see it because I, I've been to different areas of Percy Priest. Um, I thought I'd been all over, but apparently I hadn't been here before. This is just what I thought was just a boat dock, and so I was, uh, the beach was closed down for winter, and I thought, oh, bummer, I don't know how I'm gonna do four different shoots and get different looks, uh, considering that it's just a boat dock, but it's not just a boat dock because it is, it's pretty epic. Um, hang on and I'm gonna insert some So this is the parking lot. This is where you come in from. Um, you just go to 12230 uh, Old Hickory Boulevard in her all colors. Um, some, definitely some fall leaves. Um, and just these little, uh, I think they're supposed to be docks, but the water's down really low. So there's all that. A little talk. Here's your little bit and that is like an isthmus that connects, I don't know if that's the right term, that's what we call them in Florida, just a little strip of land that connects this larger piece of land to that beach over there. And if you walk this way, you are greeted by almost, <laughs> almost a 360 degree view of the beach. There's a little bit of foliage right here, you see it? I don't know if you can see it, the sun's really bright right now. Uh, you can get Percy Priest water vibes over here, but you get greenery water vibes instead of sandy ones. Uh, you can go over this way and see that tall grass with the gold sun setting behind it and the leaves, you get fall vibes. Or, if you feel like you just really want some beach vibes, you can do this. This is more like a, you know, that typical Percy Priest lake vibe with rocks in the sand. Over here, you see it now? You see like there's the foliage and there's this tall grass. If you put somebody in that tall grass right there and you get down lower, it's almost like a fall setting, but then you have the beautiful river behind there. Uh, or you could go over here, Lake Vibe, with just greenery surrounding it and fall foliage, and you can walk all the way out there by the water on the greenery um, with this tall grass in the background, or that tall grass in the background, which is really amazing looking. So, uh, but if you have a long enough lens on, you can capture all of this in the background without even moving your clients or your subjects too much. Um, that, between that and the fact that there's so much room for so much different I don't know. I like that there's like eight different vibes you could go for. Um, but then you head back here and you have like this whole area to yourself pretty much. Um, of course, because it's fall slash winter, but even you can even go back there. There's just like a dark area back in the woods. Um, I may do a piece of my final shoot back there, um, but there's woods, not a lot of foliage because the trees are kind of naked already. Um, but if you walk further this way, there's paths through the woods up um, this way. Um, or you can walk just around on the beach like I'm doing. Uh, it's a little bit rocky, so it's kind of hard to walk on in heels or whatever, but um, if you're not in heels, <laughs> um, isn't this gorgeous? I'm just obsessed with it. Long story short, if you are in the Nashville area and you're a photographer and you're looking for something all-encompassing uh, or somewhere where you can do mini sessions or something like that, look at all these different vibes. Yeah? Isn't that amazing? This is uh, it's called the Cook's Landing Pier, and it's at 12230 Old Hickory Boulevard. It's just past um, like the dam where you go to um, feed the ducks. So I think it's the old nat our natural source. So, again, I'm April Hunt. I hope this was um, educational in some way. Thanks for watching.